Yo, what is going on, guys? Um, so today we are reacting to another cops funniest wildest moments by the ultimate compilations make sure to go check them out this is a 30 minute video i don't know if we're gonna watch the whole thing also i decided to go on the uh, website version of youtube because the app version is just like complete trash so hopefully this is better into a uh, pole apparently knocked it down and then uh, got out of the car and i can't hear shit it. Oh, okay, that's why my headset was turned on. No, not at all. Okay, that's loud as fuck, so I'm gonna turn that back down. Holy shit. You guys won't notice because it's through my headset. That's your wife's car. And my car, too. And your car, too. Alright. What did you hit over there? No, I think. Probably a corner of a curb or something. Corner of a curb? Yeah. I know what I did. And Damn. So right. Were you guys fighting at all today? Were you guys no, in an argument? No, no we fighting? Because we, we you said you guys were arguing. No. He's just drunk. Freaking idiot. She should have freaking died in that accident. Wow. He's getting a horse. Oh, damn. How long have you been married? For a month. One month. <laughs> 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 she said, we've been married for a month, we're getting a fucking divorce. Wow. Bro, that's fucking hilarious. Holy sh- oh shit. <laughs> Bro, that was fucking hilarious. Get a gun in his pants. Here's a little marijuana and a little rock cocaine. I don't care. I don't care for protection. I just picked it up off the ground today. How about the coke? What coke? The rock cocaine. Rock cocaine? Yeah. Twist it up in that little receipt, the little wrapper. I ain't had no rock cocaine. Y'all must have planted that on me or something. I ain't had no damn rock cocaine. <laughs> yeah, I was gonna fucking Quit for that. Quit being mad at them because it's not their fault. You only it have one fault. Oh shit, I didn't know PlayStation for. Did that and during the download? Me. I'm downloading Hitman 2, so I'm gonna have that up. I'm gonna do a video on that. Oh, just got a Discord message. Your face is not as small up as hers is. No, so it's small. And why is that? I guess I'll get harder. I don't believe in hitting women. That kind of contradictory, isn't it? I understand that. Why don't you look at that? That's our boy on our scooter from earlier. He's riding that thing again. I just gave him a break. And now he wants to ride it down Bay Vista. So we're going to see what his deal is. You know, I gave you the opportunity. I told you to walk it. Walking all into a... Until you, until you saw that we weren't around you anymore, you decided to ride it. You decided to listen. What's up with this, man? This bag of crystal meth. What's up with that? This is dummy, big dummy. A lot of, uh, a lot of drugs and prostitution activity. Oh, wait, guys, that's These the video's odd audio cutting it's in and like out like that. There's somebody in their car over here. What are you doing here, sir? Nothing much. I'm just waiting for my friend. What's your, what's your friend's name? My friend name is Raj. He didn't even roll the okay. window down all the way. It's all sus. And where is Raj? Raj sitting inside in there. Okay. Is he coming back out to you? Yeah, he told me he was going to come back out. Okay. Huh? the baggie that was on your lap? Uh, I just, I sat over here and then I fell asleep and then, uh, and you woke up with that on your lap? Yes. Oh is my that God. Maybe something that could help you fall asleep or? No, 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 no. Or probably the opposite. And while I'm here. Yeah. Uh, what is this? I have no clue. Oh my god. Okay. I'm pretty sure it's methamphetamine. Bro, it's so amazing how stupid that. people get I mean, once they realize that? they got caught. On weed? Sometimes I see Just weed. weed. Yes. I'm looking at your eyes. I, I know you're high, okay? I smoke weed? Not, not, not that kind of <laughs> It's not going to be marijuana. That's why I'm asking. Is there yeah. anything that you've done that's going to cause your, physiologically, all these symptoms to show up? I had a monster drink like about an hour. Oh my ago. god. That does it. Go ahead and have a seat for me. <laughs>
Susan, uh, I, you know what? I have no proof. But you sent a message several hours ago saying you have snow and weed, baby, and we can party a little. I'm sorry, that wasn't mine. Yeah, that wasn't mine. Yeah, partying at the fucking jail. Jail no, cell. So. Maybe a hundred for an hour, so it sounds like haggling on her price. None of that is your Oh, price. damn. Do that, I, I'm not believing your story. It's not making any sense. <laughs> But you should ask for phone. Get the fuck out of here. I was showing up on a call where uh, uh, the victims found a suspect inside his vehicle attempting to steal it. So you can see right where he put it, he slammed the screwdriver in and broke oh, okay. the lock. Because I went to see if it would lock again. Okay. You don't normally use that to start your vehicle. No. I he, you. Okay. So he was in the driver's side? Yeah. Sitting inside the vehicle or kind of no, he was in? inside the vehicle. He was getting ready to go. And the vehicle I, was running already. Yeah, it was already running. I went to park. Sixty-nine percent. There it is. I, actually, <laughs> it was her car, but I I was taking the wrong car. How did you start the vehicle? Ignition. My 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 keys started her ignition. Where's the key at? Uh, it's in my pocket. It's in your pocket. Yeah. Okay. I don't see any keys there, buddy. No, it might be. I don't know. It's in the it's in the ha apartment, actually. It's in the apartment. Yeah. So, uh, but I don't understand. You said you started the vehicle with the key, and you can see the damage, the ignition. According to the victim, this damage was not there before. But you're saying you started the vehicle with the key, but we can't find that key. It's in my pocket. Maybe. Okay, we we checked your pockets. You don't have. Actually, this is a newer. A uh, video here, I'm sure by that explorer in the background. Registered owner of the vehicle was, uh, has How east that clip was. It looks like you might have a warrant. You know anything about that? No, I do not. Is this your current address here on page? Yes, sir. Yeah. I ran your plate in your name and you've got a warrant. Are you boxing me? <laughs> it's because I'm, I'm brown? Oh my god. Alright, do me a favor, step out. Do not open my door. Do get out of the car. Do not hurt me. Get out of the car. Why? Step out of the car. Why? You're under arrest. Why? Stop out of the car. Why? Stop harassing me. I want the ambulance here. Please, I want to. Okay. For what? License position here. Okay. Right now. What do you need an ambulance for? Because I'm hurt. What hurts? Tell me what hurts. Your feelings? The injustice here. The injustice hurts. I'm sorry they don't make it. Oh my god. Bad. <laughs> I'm gonna search your car. Is there anything else illegal in there? He closed the door and I'm just like, yeah, fuck you, dude. I don't care what you guys say. He's going to jail for the first warrant, but uh, now he has two along with charges of resisting arrest, possession Damn. of marijuana, and the felony for the methamphetamine. All right, we're gonna stop this car in here. That was because uh, this plate that's on the car is showing lots of stolen. And usually, sometimes suspects with their due, once they steal a car, they'll put another plate on there. So we're gonna go ahead and contact to see if this car is a stolen vehicle or not. This is not even my car, but like I'm okay. not my own. That's right. You take my wig off. Take your wig off. Yeah. <laughs> but you got anything under it? No, hell no. I was just wearing it because. Okay. Yeah. So this is a method. <laughs> They use smoking the methamphetamine right here. The guy stole the car for five thousand bucks, and he, he was like, "Okay, you got the test drive if you want." And I'm like, "All right." So I was going to give him five thousand. This Chinese guy. He reminds me of that guy from. He reminds me of one of those guys from Trailer Park Boys. The way he talks. No, I drink. I drink something. I'm not gonna find no dope. Oh my god. Yeah. Guarantee it. There's a sawed off shotgun right there. And it's got oh, one damn. in the chamber. Oh, they ground the serial number off. So it's obviously a stolen gun. The serial number would be right there. They're probably robbing people. Using the mask to kind of cover themselves. There's yeah. a bunch of dope in the car. I mean, the, this whole situation is not good, right? Yeah, it's not. It's bad. It <laughs> so. I would, I would do it. I swear to you, I didn't know that gun was a gun. He tell you there's a gun in the car? He didn't tell me that. That's what no? I'm telling you. Okay. All right. All I know is he said it was all set up. It's all they set you up, huh? You're being arrested for the stolen car. You're being arrested for the firearm. That's it's not even mine, up. though. You're in possession of it, though. What What else you got in here that I'm gonna find? Uh, What's in here? Just some more marijuana. I'll just say I just found the container outside my house. So is it? Yeah. Okay. Like I said, I don't know. I found it outside of my house. Alright, I'm a lot faster than you think. I like how these cops go through seven month fucking trainings and these 
people talk to them like I told you we're gonna get away. They're not even that Didn't like they're not even yeah. smart. Like come yeah. on, people I, like are you that you dumb? These cops it's had so much you training. Not gonna no pipe. And sh well, it's this, it's uh, just so stupid how how they honestly she's think in, that uh, she's in congested traffic. It looks like they're gonna believe that shit. But yeah, but I mean, I'm not out here. I don't care if the cop is like 19 fucking years old, they still fucking know. And there are young cops down here that are that age. Because you can legally become an officer down here in 19. What is that? That didn't come from me. Yeah, it did. It just fell from you. What is it? <laughs> that ain't from me, but it just fell out of her. Fell out of her. <laughs> I mean, it is what it is. Those are police ants. <laughs> Oh, damn. You think you're getting right away? Some good reflexes by the cops, though. And after you were in cops, where were you going to go when you started running away? Far as I last my last minute of freedom. They've just dispatched <laughs> monsters on a. Uh, he's not. He's not lying about that one. What happened, Teresa? Oh, I to my friend's truck. The person was in my way because they were going too slow. Was that a Ford or a Chevy? You took their truck to prove a point. Yes. And what point was that? That I'm all my body and soul. That you're what? Since we've been standing here talking in the last two minutes, how many cars have come by? Several hundred? And you only managed to hit one? That's extremely lucky. That's because they were already on that. That's because they were paying attention and not intoxicated. No. She hit the white SUV right there. She swerves all the way across all three lanes. She takes out three trees, goes on Damn. to the access road. Overcorrects again and comes back out where she came to rest in that center lane. I'm here. For what? I'm here. For what? I just want to pat you down, my man. Uh, man. Let me see your hands. Get out. <laughs> you know how to do it. You've been arrested before. Come on. Hey. All right. Come on. I got a dog coming. You go up underneath that house? Ain't nothing under the house. No, if, it, if it is something underneath, it ain't mine. I'm telling you that now. Now you can you can just take my word and just let me go. I ain't trying to go back to jail. I'm on a straight and narrow road to success. Assist uh, my corporal in serving a uh, outstanding warrant on a subject. Uh, I believe it's for child support. How you doing? I need you to come out here. All right, put him up and you come back out here. Boy, he just dipped. <laughs> I'm not even surprised, though, but it's funny. Get on the ground! Bring your hands behind your back! Put your hands behind your back. Give me your hand. Anything, huh? I didn't even it. Like I said, I didn't know up until we were getting ready for us here that you guys were the cops. You talk to me at the front door. You talk to this deputy at the front door. Don't sit here. And feed us full of lives. Okay, well, I had, I had to use the restroom. Was the restroom? Oh, you can hear it in his voice. You know he fucked up. Me and my mom got to a disagreement because Samuel over there is my ex boyfriend. I used to date. Oh, I saw this one before. I actually saw this he episode. He left me for my mom, and then he just ran after me a minute ago with the taser. This is not the first time he's came after me. So, what was the disagreement over? What was the deal? It was because I wanted to hang out with her. But she didn't want me to hang out with her because her boyfriend is my ex-boyfriend and she does not trust us together. My mom told him that if he continued dating me because I was under the age, that he was, she was going to have him arrested. So he left me and ended up going to her. started dating your mom? Yeah. You got a warrant for your arrest. Go ahead and drop a cigarette. Do you want to worry about him and her being together? No. Yeah, that's, that's what she said. If he wants to be hurt, oh well, I don't care. We got to go now. I got out of jail and didn't have nowhere to stay. I met them. My mom had to stay at the house. About two days later, my mom caught us kissing and then said she was going to throw me in jail. And, uh, I just oh, got she out. Said she was. 
She told me, she, I think she was like 13 or 14, or 14 something like that. Why don't you have a seat right over there first? I couldn't tell that she was 13 years old. I'm assuming like 20 years old now, man. She looks like a kid. Well, she had makeup on. She, they can act older than what they are. Oh, yeah? You know. As long as you choose Eddie over me, yeah. I'm done. Uh-huh. I'm not going to come over here and hang out with uh-huh. you at all. Well, auto burglary in progress. Apparently, the suspect's still inside the vehicle. Let's see if we can locate him. We're right around the corner. Let me see your hands. Stay right there. Stay right there inside the car. Stay right here. What you got? Here? That was hard. Step it up. What's your What's your highest level of education? Seventh grade. Seventh grade. Yeah. Damn. So what were you doing inside the vehicle? Waiting for somebody to come late to. Okay. You know what I'm talking about? No, I don't. Because I'm waiting. You waiting? I'm waiting to see if somebody's trying to come back. See what we're trying to get with inside that car. Oh, so you're you're protecting the car from somebody else trying to break in? Yes, sir. Oh, okay. I see. So you're like neighborhood watch. <laughs> that dispatch the uh, domestic arm. The weapon is going to be on Maddie's boyfriend against uh, girlfriend. Again. He busted my eye open here. He ch- he tried to say I hit his dad, but his dad. But his dad said I didn't hear him. All I did was want to take my clothes and leave. What happened? Stop right there. Look, she smashed me in the head. I mean, come on, dude. If I want to hurt, I'm a big guy, man. I'm not going to do nothing to her. He punched me in my head a couple times. He choked me. He punched me in my eye. This is like the first time I've been here. Tonight, obviously, we're getting two sides of the story. The fucking time, bro. And we don't have an independent minister. Shit. If it was the second time down here, <laughs> somebody would have been arrested. So five times someone got arrested. I don't know where the hell they're at, but damn. They're leaning it like a motherfucker. Going to an assault with this occurred. Apparently a couple neighbors got in a fight. Or a white male was not wearing Yeah, I was open that back window up. And I didn't want to pop the screen, I just wanted to pull the window through. No sense getting the screen all broke loose. And he insisted, man, you can drink a lobster. So this all happened over here. Yeah. About what? About me making a suggestion about how, you know, how to take out those windows. Because he wanted air. So this is all about you making a suggestion right. he for said, windows. Right. Okay. Yeah, that's what this is over. He insisted I pulled that board out of there on taking that back screen off. There's a two-by-four, a piece of the two-by-four that went across the top of our window. Yep. And it was above the window. He pried it off, and it hit him in, you know, the nose. So then how did he get his injuries? I, I grabbed him and tapped him down. I said, you know, made it look like a citizen's arrest on his ass. He can't do that, my old Bob. Weren't you guys both over here talking about that? You invited him over here. Hit me from behind, kind of stumbled me. Then he came and hit me again, and I fell down. And he started kicking me and hit me again and told me, I, I'm not supposed to have any ideas. Hey, guys, I'm going to see oh, I thought there was no hood on that car for a second. What the fuck? I'll put that out. What do you mean, how could that I mean, this I don't is have America. a right to some old puppy man's going to insist on breaking through my back <laughs> screen. He just needs to know if someone's offering help, maybe to take their advice instead of getting angry when they say something that he doesn't like. Got going on right here. 443 County. It looks like I'm getting weighed down with a white male. I look up and there's that guy sitting on the top of the stairs. He yells and goes, what are you looking at, you privacy rapist? And I was, <laughs> so I kept walking. And then all of a sudden I saw the knife. And then he popped it open. So it So he made a physical movement. Oh, he open. opened up and he actually ran after it. Chased okay. me. Chased me with a what door was the knife? So, he was in the jail? I don't know. We're going to go talk about it. Okay. We're going to go outside and make sure you're who we think you are. Why would you be going to jail? I don't know. Because I had an anger outburst. Because you had an anger outburst? Yeah. What did you do with the knife? <laughs> I didn't have a knife. Okay. When he walked by and he looked up here, what would you say to him that made him laugh? Um, I said, you're, you're a privacy rapist. So why don't you tell me the rest of the truth about where the knife is. And then we're done. It's, uh, it's packed away in boxes. That dude looks sus, though. 
That's yeah, that's my knife right there. Okay. Would that be it? Exactly. That's the Okay. Thank you, sir. You didn't chase after him with the knife? No. So why does he say that's exactly the knife you used? I don't know. I don't know. Uh, right now we're going to a... Uh, all right, yeah, I'm going to end this here. Uh, we've been recording for about 20 minutes so far, so... Um, yeah, this was that. Uh, this was a pretty funny episode. Um, but if you guys want to see some more of these reaction videos, just let me know. And uh, yeah, I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.